I just read a Reuters article and government right from the beginning hasn't known its arse from its elbow. It's an absolute catastrophe. Our government implemented a plan of herd immunity. Let's take it on the chin. Let's do nothing. Let's all get the virus. And right now, according to the Office of National Statistics, all they're doing is managing the death toll, the daily death rate, so we don't feel too bad. Is that it? It's 80% higher. Look at this. UK is going to have Europe's worst coronavirus death toll. It's in The Guardian. France 22. Britain set for 66,000 COVID-19 deaths. Yeah, we saw Italy. We had the time. We could have stopped it. What was our government thinking? And look, look at this. Late last night, Trump said the UK's been on the phone begging for help. We need ventilators. He said, we, we want 200. And he's Lewis Goodall, he's from the sky. He said, if true, how does that fit with, 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 with our government saying, we don't want to be part of the EU ventilator scheme? How does that fit? But because of Brexit, because of because of blue passports and 50p's, what, they're going to let people die, struggle for their last breath, because we can't... The UK, this is witty, UK must learn from Germany. They're a mean, we fucked up. We should have tested earlier. The world was screaming at our government. The World Health Organization was test, test, test. What bit of that didn't they understand? Tell me. What didn't they know? What didn't they understand? Care homes are used to goodbyes. Have you seen this? We will never get, forget watching families comfort COVID through the windows, giving them one last hug. And we, we've, got, we've got care workers without any protection. Care homes, it's not a time, it's, it's happening now. This is the Reuters article. Go and have a read of it. Our government's fucked up and all they're doing is managing the death toll. 